it's been described as the most extraordinary spectacle in musical theatre history. That's quite a description, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Broadway blockbuster Aladdin is coming to New Zealand in early January and it has a new lead. Kiwi Ray's Graham Isiako is set to take the reins as the title character and he joins us now along with Shrubshri Kandia who plays the Sultan's princess daughter Jasmine. It is great to have you both here. Yeah! And of course sure. the lamp as well. I mean congrats Graham. So Ainsley Mellum, he's stepping down as Aladdin after the Perth run and so you've been his stand-in, is that correct? Yeah, I've been his understudy for two years now. And so now you get to step in and do, do this? Yeah, in our hometown. Oh, oh he's home! Yes. <laughs> oh, I'm, so, I'm super excited. Um, you know, to come home and to to do this with our Fano, with all our people and to to lead a show like this at this um, kind of level and the calibre yeah. that it is is just amazing. And how many friends and family are you going to have filling up that theatre every night? Five shows a week. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nice, well get your tickets quick because they are selling fast here <laughs> in New Zealand. Uh, and Shubshree, congratulations, you're playing Jasmine. Are you doing a bit of Jasmine in Australia at the moment? Yes, I'm uh, the Jasmine for the Perth season at the moment and yeah, we're really looking forward to coming here next year. And how exciting is it to have a new man, I guess, for the New Zealand show? Is the chemistry <laughs> there? Is it all, you know, going to plan so far? Well, Graham and I got on, like, so well from day one when I joined the company, so it's so exciting to have, like, even just a friend with me up yeah, on stage. Great. So, yeah. Because you're a tight-knit family, you yeah. know, when, when you're on tour. Yeah, it must be hard work too. I mean, performing, it's pretty intense, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, we go through some gruelling stages with the body and the mind and, you know, really trying to portray these characters day after day, but it's it's essential that you look after yourself. There are worse things you could be doing, that is for sure. <laughs> hey, how did you get into the whole sort of musical theatre thing? Um, I grew up performing, doing a lot of Indian dance and stuff, and um, I think it was more in high school that I kind of branched out into music theatre and then just realised I loved it and that's what I wanted to do. And what was the first musical theatre audition that you did that kind of led you to being on massive stages? Um, Can you remember? Like first one at a uni? Or? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> My first one out of uni is was this one. Brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Okay, you got one on the back of your hand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And um, uh, about Jasmine, if Jasmine was to write a Tinder profile, how would you describe Stop. her? <laughs> um, I'd say she is a feisty, independent woman that stands up for what she believes in, and um, yeah, that's what I, I love about her as a character. That's what we all love about her. Yeah. So, Graham, how did yeah. you get into this whole musical theatre thing? What's your background? Look, I'm a poly, I'm Māori, you know, I'm, I, I've always sung at home, and there's always been a guitar at a family barbecue, so it's kind of just thread through my blood, to be honest, and in church, at Sunday school, so I kind of just fell into it, and I've always loved it, and decided to study it, and here we are. How proud are your family of you right yeah. now? Oh, big time. You know, the mana and the love is just so, just overwhelming. You know, the fact that we're here, you know, to promote it is, they're all just so excited. I can just imagine. You're going to have, like, cousins and all sorts coming out of the woodwork. Like, yeah. somebody you went to school cousins, with, you Cousins, cousins. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Cousin I met him once. <laughs> so just to quickly tell us a bit about your background. How much time did you spend here in New Zealand? Did you do any singing before you left for Australia, or were you uh, too young? Bits and bobs. I mean, I was, I, I, I grew up here until I was about seven. Right. And then I moved back to Australia, and the majority of my studying was there. Nice. Yeah. Okay, and I'll ask you the same question. If Aladdin was to write a Tinder profile, what do you say? <laughs> <laughs> How would he describe himself? Cheeky. Yeah. Um, uh, mischievous, he is, he's spunky, he's fun, he's got a big heart. He's got nice. a big heart. Okay. He's exactly he's probably Graham really a romantic Oh, style. that's so sweet. <laughs> now, the <laughs> show sounds so impressive. We heard some pretty impressive facts, mm. uh, which I've got written down here, uh, when we had Ainsley along with George Hanare and Gareth Jacobs in uh, talking about it. So this is, this is some of them. So it's got a cast of 34. 337 glittering costumes, <laughs> 1,225 different fabrics, uh, 712 different styles of beads, 500,000 Swarovski crystals. Yeah. <laughs> wow! What is it like to wear that kind of thing? Um, well, like the first so time I put on my costume, I was like, I'm a princess. Like those costumes just make, there's so much detail in them and you just feel incredible wearing them. And like my wedding skirt alone, I think has like 5,000 individually sewn so on yeah. beads. And it's it's beautiful and it's really heavy and it's, yeah, it's just, it's amazing. It's real, you know, you really yeah. do feel like you're one of these characters, yeah. you know, and you are a prince and your cape and... It's phenomenal. Yeah. It is a musical production on steroids, isn't it? <laughs> but honestly, it's just got everything, everything that you want, including a flying carpet. Is that uh -huh. the wow moment in the show? Uh, it definitely is the moment where your heart is 
is really hit and for us you know to be able to do that every night is is such a privilege mm. you know you it the stars and then just people after telling you about this and they're crying about it. it's just it's phenomenal yeah. and Chapshree, what's your favorite song to sing uh, mine's actually one that's not in the in the um, film. It's called A Million Miles Away. So you'll have to come to the show to see it. Oh, but nice little tease yeah. there. Yeah. <laughs> what, what do you tell your friends when you're describing the whole show? What, how do you, what do you tell them it's about? The show itself? Mm. I, I, always. It's, it's a big show. It's a massive Broadway show that we're bringing to our side of the world. Awesome. Mm. So exciting. Looking Welcome forward home. to seeing it. Yeah. Hey, thanks guys for joining us. Thank you. Tickets for the Auckland season of the Broadway sensation Aladdin are on sale right now. Performances begin on 3rd of January at the Amazing Pacific Theatre. You can check out Ticketmaster for details. You do not want to miss it. I cannot wait. Okay, mm. thank you guys so much. Thank we'll you. see you soon.